Hey, how's it going everybody? Hope you guys are having a good day. Today we're back in Outpost Zimonja, continuing on with our build. And this should be one of the last builds, if not the last, because as you can see we're running out of space. And I don't want to make it feel too packed, if you know what I mean. Um, I don't want buildings, you know, in the middle here. But anyway, what we're doing today is building a, another boxcar house. If you can't tell, I love the boxcars. So let's get right into it. Okay, so let's get started. Um, this build, it started off pretty simple because I wasn't exactly sure what I wanted to build, but in the end it turned out pretty cool. And you could use this build in pretty much any settlement because the boxcars look so good in any settlement. Um, like you saw I used in my uh, Oberlin Station build. If you haven't seen that, definitely check it out. So just going to... It starts off simple, just three three box cars. If, uh, if I could get this one in, I think I have to raise it up. This ground's really uneven, so it was pretty hard to find something. Initially, I wanted to use uh, buses in this area, but that was not going to happen. I tried for like an hour to get a normal-looking bus build, and it just was not happening. Okay, so you can see I, mi I mixed up the uh, textures a little bit, um, add a little bit of character. Now next, what I do is go to the wood prefabs, and I just uh, I snap two of these on here, like so. You can see, and I'm not going to leave that floating, obviously, so I'm just going to see if I can snap a couple of these in there. Earlier I was having some trouble getting these under, hopefully they'll go in easier. Got one in, see if I can get this one, maybe I have to rotate it. Having some trouble earlier. I don't know if uh, they don't really like going in. Come on. Let's see if I can. Uh, I don't think they want to go in. Let me, let me try this side. It's so difficult to get these in with the unlevel ground and. It was just hard to find something that actually looked good in this area, and I'm really happy with the with the way this build turned out, especially because I love the box cars. I just love how they look. And get this in, hopefully. Come on, it's so close. Almost. There we go. Um, it's not perfect, but I'll definitely fix that when I go back and decorate. So let me see if I can get the two on this side. I don't want to waste too much time with these because you can obviously tell what I'm trying to do, but I see. I don't think I'm going to be able to get them in right now. I don't want to waste too much time just me sitting here trying to snap these in. So I think I'm just going to do that when I decorate. Okay, so anyway, you get the idea. So next, what I'm going to do is grab just the normal stairs in the warehouse tab. See if these will go on. I don't think they'll go on because that scaffolding right there. I snap these on. Come on. Okay. And then what I'm going to do is just put some railings on, just some normal railings. I still use the wood railings because they're my favorite. I think they look the best and they you can really use them on anything. I just think they look really good. Don't get me wrong, I do like the metal ones, but I just like the wood ones more. They feel more scrappy, Fallout-esque. Okay, so next, um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to build a scaffolding back here to where you can actually get on top and there's gonna be like a little seating area on top of the uh, of the box car now this oh boy this this took forever to get in first time um, it's not that it's difficult it's just time consuming because you have to keep going back and forth um, with this checking to see if it's a level with the top so pretty much what you do is you set the long one in and then lower it into the ground and then you get the shorter one and then you snap it on and you try to make it completely level with the top of the box car now it's not difficult 
to do per se, but it takes a lot of time. So instead of you guys just sitting here watching me try to get that in, what I'll do is I'll cut and I'll have it in and I'll show you how to build on the top. So I'll be right back. Okay guys, so I finally got it to the right position. As you can see, when I put the floor in, it's right on top of the top of the box car. So next what we're going to do is go back to the prefabs. And what I grab, I think I use these. Yeah, okay. So I use these um just for the reason that it has a back wall, so you can't really see out this way. And then on this side you have the, the roof and you can see out this way. I, I don't know why I really chose it, I just thought it looked cool. So next we're going to just snap a wall right here. And then go to concrete. And I want to use these old railings. I haven't used these in a while, I really like these. Snap a couple of these in. Sorry if you hear that in the background. I think somebody's mowing. So sorry if you hear that. Okay, so pretty much done with the uh, the build. And what I did as well is I fixed the floor in the front so it's not just floating. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to decorate and then I will come back and show you guys a finished tour. Okay guys, so I just finished decorating as you can see and I just wanted to give you a look from far away. And in my opinion, it looks really cool. Uh, it looks like it really fits in the settlement. If you can see, it just it really fits in. So I'll give you a tour as you can see. Um, inside I went with some different lighting <laughs> than usual. Kind of want to make it feel, you know, a different vibe to it. So I think it turned out pretty cool. Got the disco ball, you can barely even tell. But and that kind of clips through. I noticed that happens on the box cars, um, the little traffic light. But you know. Anyway, did some simple decoration. Um, got the bed, the flags. And I'll show you the top. You can see I put a little balcony here to where you could just walk right up. And then up here I think it looks pretty cool uh, it definitely turned out how I wanted it to better than I thought it was going to turn out because uh, initially when I couldn't get the bus in I was like oh no this is going to look bad I'm going to have to just stuff something in there but no it actually turned out better and I'm really happy with this now if you guys enjoyed this video please leave it a like I'd really appreciate it and if you enjoy my content please subscribe to my channel um, I should have a tour up today um, if I decide not to build anything and just do the rest uh, decoration. But if I do decide to build something else, that should be up today. So if you enjoyed this video, leave it a like and subscribe to my channel and I'll catch you guys soon.